Hello and welcome, I am Grim, and this is Forest Village. Okay, so I've played a couple of years, so we're now into Spring Year 7. And I've actually managed to survive so far, which is unlike me. And as you can see, there's no deaths recently. There's a chicken attack, but uh, yeah, people are alive and living. So I've uh, set up obviously a couple of foresters and I'm just working with the one lumberjack but constantly throughout the year. I might have to put in a second one actually just now because we are starting to run a little bit lower at the end of the season. So I just want to make sure that I do have enough woods this time around. Uh, but the next thing I'm going to be doing is a, another what are you foresters over there, and that is a stone quarry, because I'm now out of stone as well. And we've just gone ahead and put an orchard in up here, and another coop in down here, as well as a small house. And we've expanded the small shacks and improved, I think, all of them now as well. So we're getting a, a good amount of people. <laughs> We've got uh, five teenagers hopefully on the way and it looks like eight babies. So I'm probably going to have to start looking at expanding into this area and getting that ready for the next phase of building. But, uh, we'll catch up with you in a little bit anyway and we'll see how things are progressing. Looks like we've got uh, another fire going, but luckily enough, I do have wells dotted around all over the place. Apart from up here, I kind of want another one, which is why I've now had to build the stone quarry. So we can get stone to build as well. And so I've gone ahead and I've planned out a section, quite a large bit there, to flatten off. So we can start on another tier and some more building space. I'll probably put a, a road in down here, uh, maybe quite a wide one, uh, and then maybe start building a more impressive town area a little bit further back as well. But, uh, we'll see how it goes, as long as I can keep on top of the resources uh, and the firewoods and things, then it should be okay, in theory. Okay, just as I feared, there are a few houses going a bit hungry. Uh, how many chickens do we have to kill? A few that might help a little bit. Don't want to reduce it too low. I think about eight is about as much as I want to push it for now. But, uh, hopefully, a little bit of meat will go. Go away for, for helping them, but you know, it's probably more the hunters and fishermen. And I have hopefully yep, started construction of a fisherman's lodge here as well. Uh, I'll maybe drop a couple more of the builders into fishing, maybe a couple more of the hunters as well, seeing as they don't seem to be doing too much on gathering meat at the moment. So it looks like everyone is getting hungry. Oh, that's not a good sign. Come on guys, finish finish the fisherman's lodge. Or at least get to spring. Uh, right, what can we do? Who's doing what? Two cold still for apples. Uh, gatherer, I'm guessing it's still too cold. Okay, we'll keep you, keep you as hunters just now. Bring it back up to speed. Yeah, that's one death. That's another one. Oh, it's, this isn't going good. Uh, so six people dead. 
seven. Oh, oh, oh. That's quite a few now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <sighs> That's not good. That's what, another one, nine. Oh, everything was going so well. I just. I lose track on food. Damn it. Come on guys, survive. Uh mm -hmm. whoever you are, you can hopefully come and build this. Um I'm hoping this might work if we can get this built just as soon as we can. Uh, throw everyone into fishing. Uh, that might work. That's about the only thing I can think anyway at the moment. It's still just a little bit too cold for farms. And to be honest, they're going to take a while. Right, where's the people? Let's slow this back down. People, what are you doing? No builders, give us fishermen. Uh, no hunters. We need another herdsman though. Uh, we'll bring you out of there. Go into hunting. Okay. Alright, bring up. Back up to speed. Uh, uh, chickens dying. Fishermen starve to death. Herdsmen's oh, not another herdsman. We need you guys. Uh, oh, this is. That's about all I can do. Come on, you five guys. There is food. Please eat. There is meat. Come on, survive. Survive, you three people. Uh, people, what are you doing, actually? Uh... You two peoples. Oh god. I can see where this is going. No peoples. No two peoples. Teenagers starving to death. <laughs> Chickens dying in attacks. I can bring back from here. Hmm? You killed that wolf. I'll jump out of you, was there? Hmm. There's a fox around here as well, we'll kill you. Alright, save the chickens. Did I save the people? Hit the speed again. Uh, hmm. What people are left? You or a hmm. bloke? Oh, is that two blokes? Um. Okay, so... <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, I don't 
know how well this is gonna survive with these three people. I think they're all men as well. Or male at least. Uh, yeah, Alan isn't really a female sounding name and you don't look like okay so I guess uh, yeah we're gonna probably start again I think so remember keep an eye on food and keep an eye on on firewood. Uh, don't let your population run too much out of control without giving them adequate farms. So, but I guess 20 odd, well there was about 8 children coming as well. So, by about 30 people you want to have a lot more farms than what I currently do. Uh, maybe a few smaller ones so they're quick and easy to, to go through. Uh, and then constant supplies of foods, which are easy to take, like some apples and things. Uh, and fishing, I guess. I don't know how how well this is going to last, as I said, with the three men. Uh, or two men, and... Nope, teenager Alan died. So, yeah. Uh... I guess thanks for watching. Uh, if you like what you've seen, remember to give a thumbs up, subscribe, and go check out Meta's channel as well. Okay, thanks now. Bye bye.